cords dangling from above, torn out carpet, gaping holes in the ceiling, and empty bookshelves. What you're looking at is the inside of the Post Falls Library and the damages it suffered during January's cold snap. Officials say they're likely looking at over a million dollars worth of damages and loss. Insurance will cover the repairs, but the claim won't be enough to replace all that was lost. Marissa Rio shares how you can step in and help. A community hub is now plagued with emptiness. Officials say over 1,000 people used to come in and out of the library every day. One says she misses the shrieks of laughter she'd hear during story time. Staff are ready for repairs to begin, but they first need to clear out the entire library. We have 63,000 items here at the Post Falls Library, and we have about four to six weeks to pack everything up so that we can get construction started on the library to repair all the damage that happened in January. But but the Post Falls Library has less than 10 staff members, and that's over 300 boxes of items that they need to pack a day in order to get the job done. We have tasks for everybody, so if you can't lift heavy boxes, that's okay. We have some book washing stations and things like that. We need help making the boxes, so 6,000 boxes, a lot of boxes to make, so people can come and help us with that. Staff hope they can get enough volunteers so that they can finish this job as quickly as possible. The Post Falls Library is also asking for donations. If you have books or any other small items that you can donate, you can stop by and drop them off in their book return box right out front. They are also taking monetary donations to help replace items like audiobooks, baby board books, puppets they used to use during story time, and more. A lot of people think, oh, why does the library need toys? And toys are so vital in early learning development and fine motor skills and things that like that that all impact reading as they grow um, and so being able to replace those items so yes the families can have the same experience that they did before we had to close. For more information on how you can make a difference you can visit our website at kxly.com. Reporting in Post Falls, Marissa Rio, 4 News Now.